Hello children, good morning. Welcome in today's class. Children, today we will continue the lesson Reproduction in Animals. And today we will read about the life cycle of insect. We have already completed the life cycle of a insect that is cockroach. Today we will continue the life cycle of butterfly. Okay. And how she, it takes care, how other animals take care of their young ones and different topics. We will do the book exercises and we will complete the notebook work also. Today we will write the defined words of the lesson. Okay children, let's read one by one. I am going to share the PDF of the book pages where you will find these things. Let's learn. Yes, this is the life cycle of butterfly. Insects such as butterflies, housefly and moth. They give birth to an insect that looks different from the parent insect. In cockroach, what you have seen, that names the young one, The it looks like an uh, yeah, adult cockroach. Huh? But here are the some insects where the baby insects look different from the parent insect. And this in is stage is called larva. Here you can see this is the eggs of a butterfly. And it develops into a larva, into baby insect that is called larva. And what is the specialty of larva? It is a baby insect, but it looks different from the parent insect. Look, this is different than Adults are different than Yes. And this is called larva. And larva of the butterfly, it looks like a worm. It looks like a worm. It looks like a And it is called caterpillar. A special name is there for the, for the young one of the baby insect of the butterfly. That is caterpillar. The caterpillar eats leaves. ये tree पे रहता है, leaves खाता है and grows और grow करता है. Then it makes a shell around it. अपने चारों ओर एक shell बना लेता है around its baby. अपने इसके चारों ओर जो है एक its body, अपने body के चारों ओर ऐसे एक shell बना लेता है. This shell is called cocoon. अब ना when the shell is formed, एक जिल्ली जैसा इसके चारों ओर बन जाता है, it is called cocoon and this shell is called cocoon and the caterpillars grows inside the cocoon ye dekho jo caterpillar hai wo cocoon ke andar mein grow kar raha hai here it grows and it this stage is called pupa what is pupa the pupa is when larva develops a shell like cocoon outside its body and develops inside it called pupa. Okay, the caterpillar shades this skin after some time. When it grows, it shades this skin. Ye jo apne charor ka banaya hota hai kukun, usko break karta hai. Shade gira deta hai. And finally, a butterfly comes out of a cocoon. Aur us kukun se ek young butterfly coming out from the cocoon. ये जो कुकून सा उससे क्या निकल के आती है एक यंग बटरफ्लाई एंड देन इट ग्रोज इनटू अ ब्यूटीफुल एडल्ट बटरफ्लाई और ये दूसरे बटरफ्लाइज में डेवलप हो जाती है ओके देन व्हाट इज द लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ बट दिस इज कॉल्ड द लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ अ बटरफ्लाई अ बटरफ्लाई गिव्स मेनी एग्स ऑन द लीफ एंड दिस लार्वा कम्स आउट दिस बेबी इंसेक्ट कम्स आउट फ्रॉम द एग and it looks different from the parent insect. Or ye parent insect se alag dikhta hai. It eats leaves. Bohar sari leaves ko khata hai. Hmm? It eats leaves. And it grows. Then it makes a shell around it. Aapne charo de jilli jaisa deko yaha pe bana liya hai. And this shell is called cocoon. Or shell ko hum no kya kehte hai? Cocoon kehte hai. And the cocoon. This caterpillar grows inside the cocoon and this stage is called pupa. And this stage is called pupa. And 
its further grows and shades its skin many until you know the caterpillar shades its skin many times aur bahut baar ye apne skin ko shade karta hai and fine give shade karna matlab girana and then finally it grows into a young butterfly okay and young butterfly comes out from the co cocoon and after this it become into a adult butterfly i think now you all have understood the life cycle of a butterfly yes sir yes till and this is the checkpoint the question the animals that give birth to their babies what they are called the animals that give birth to their babies you have to give the example animal that give birth to their babies you can write here any example you can write any example okay animals that give birth to their babies right here cow this is cow i am writing the small one na let me make the font bigger that you can yes now you can see her now come to the another question the white liquid around the yolk of an egg is called what it is called beta around the egg it is called albumin a l b u m e n albumin come to the third one baby insect that look like parent insect jo parent insect ke jaise dikhti hai that is called what it is called beta nymph what it is called nymph n y m p h you have seen na the larva of the cockroach look just like a cockroach yes the stage i come to fourth one the stage at which a caterpillar caterpillar grows inside the cocoon jo cocoon the stage at which caterpillar jo hai wo कुकून के अंदर ग्रो कर रहा था तो उस स्टेज को हमने क्या कहा था प्यूपा व्हाट वी से प्यूपा ओके नाउ यू ऑल कैन डू दिस यस चिल्ड्रन देयर आर सम अदर टाइप ऑफ एनिमल दैट ले एक्स वो क्या करते हैं एक्स को ले करते हैं एंड दे लाइक फिशेस दे ले एक्स इन द वाटर वाटर में देते हैं एट ए टाइम and the young fishes hatches out from them aur usme se young fish jo hai wo hatch hone lagti hai okay and we will read in detail the other things of the same lesson come to the another one you can see in this picture children the fishes give birth to fish kya karti hai bahut sare eggs deti hai it gives and it uh, and the big fishes eat the eat the small fishes and many fishes grows ha huh? many eggs and young fishes are unprotected and they are eaten by the other fishes or other fishes in chote chote fishes ko kha lete hain or some fishes such as कैट फिशेज गार्ड देयर एग्स फ्रॉम देयर एनिमीज और एक कैट फिश होती है वो क्या करती है एनिमीज से अपने एग्स को प्रोटेक्ट करती है दिस इज द पिक्चर ऑफ दैट एंड सम अदर फिश द एग्जाम्पल इज जो फिश वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग थिंग जो फिश क्या करती है अपने एग को प्रोटेक्ट करने के लिए it carry their developing babies in their mouth apne mouth ke andar baby ko rakhi rehti hai and after some time when they develops it's give out this is the protection of the egg na and children animals such as lizard snakes and turtle lay their eggs on on ground a lot of number they give their 
eggs on the ground. They do not take care of the, their egg. जो टर्टल और स्नेक होता है ना अपने एक का ये लोग केयर नहीं करते हैं मेनी ऑफ देम आर ईच एन बाय अदर एनिमल्स जो कुछ एक फ्यू बच जाते हैं दे डेवलप इनटू अ कैट इनटू अ टर्टल ओके एंड चिल्ड्रन डू यू नो एंड यंग कोकोड्राइल हैचिंग यू कैन सी इन दिस पिक्चर ना हाउ इट हैपेंस अ फीमेल क्रोकोडाइल क्या करती है डिग्स अ होल ऑन द लैंड एक गड्ढा जैसा जमीन में बनाती है डिग्स अ होल हां And lays eggs और उस जो डिग करती है उसमें अंडे को देती है अपने and cover it with dirt और जो ये dirt धूल होता है उससे अपने अब अंडे को cover कर देती है and after a few months जब जब उसमें से ये young crocodile निकलने का time होता है the mother what she does she removes the she removes वो dirt को remove कर देती है and young crocodiles hatches out from the egg you can see in this picture here it is written that some fishes such as catfishes guard their eggs from their enemies some other fishes just such as jaw fishes carry their developing babies in their mouth and lizard and snake and turtle lay their eggs on the ground they do not take care of their egg many of them are eaten by other animals इसीलिए बहुत सारे नंबर में अंडे देते हैं बट कुछ ही उसमें से डेवलप हो पाते हैं अभी फीमेल क्रोकोडाइल का मैंने बताया कि एक डिग होल इन द ग्राउंड एंड ले एग्स एंड शी देन कवर्स द एग्स विथ डर्ट धूल से कवर कर देती है और टू थ्री मंथ्स के बाद यंग वन जब रेडी टू हैच होता है देन मदर क्रोकोडाइल रिमूव द डर्ट एंड हेल्प द यंग वन टू कम आउट एंड वॉट इज द रिप्रोडक्शन द प्रोसेस बाय वेच Living thing produce their young ones. उसको क्या कहते हैं? What we say reproduction. What is reproduction? The process by which living things produce their young ones. And what is nymph? A young insect that looks like parent insect. Example क्या है? Cockroach का देखा था ना? A young insect that looks like parent insect is called nymph. And larva क्या होता है? A, it is also a young that insect that looks like different from the parent animal parent animal se alag dikhta hai to usko larva kehte jaise you have seen in the life cycle of the butterfly the caterpillar looks diff, uh, different from the butterfly na and what is molting shading of skin by animals is called molting what it is called it is called molting children let's do the book exercises I hope you all are ready with the books na it is on page number 76 you all open page number 76 dear aap sab log page number 76 open kar lo let's do we are going to solve this okay i will put a tick mark check mark ha huh? the the question is number 1 this is the process by which एनिमल प्रोड्यूस देयर यंग वंस एनिमल अपने यंग वन को प्रोड्यूस करते हैं उस प्रोसेस को क्या कहते हैं व्हाट वी से फोटोसिंथेसिस नो रिप्रोडक्शन यस दिस इज रिप्रोडक्शन ना बी इज द राइट आंसर ना प्रोड्यूस देयर यंग वंस द प्रोसेस बाय व्हिच एनिमल प्रोड्यूस देयर यंग वंस इज रिप्रोडक्शन यू विल टेक मार्क ऑन बी कम टू द अनदर वन वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग Gives birth to many babies at a time. Cow kya many babies deti hai? No. Human being? It, no. Monkey? No. Dog? Yes. Who gives many babies in one time? Dog. The right answer is dog. Come to the third one. One of the following does not lay eggs. Isme se kaun hai? Jo egg nahi deta. स्नेक यस लेजिक्स क्रोकोडाइल यस लेजिक्स बियर इट गिव बर्थ टू बेबीज बियर डज नॉट गिव बॉय लेस एग सो व्हाट इज दैट राइट आंसर बियर कम टू द अनदर वन डियर दिस इज अ बेबी फ्रॉग टैडपोल निम्फ काफ और लार्वा 
the baby frog is of course number 1 it is tit tat pole huh? a tat pole is a baby frog come to the another one this term is used for larva of a butterfly larva of a butterfly is called caterpillar what it is called here it is called caterpillar i hope you all can do this now you do this okay children let's do the other exercises hum log aur dusri exercises bhi karte hain come to the another exercise yes this is fill in the blanks what is the name of the exercise it is number b filling the blanks let me complete this chalo isko ab complete karte hain okay chalo mammals feed their young ones on their kis pe ye feed karate hain ye log on their milk m i l k milk come to the next one beta the growing the growing baby found inside an egg is called an kya kehlata hai it's called an embryo e m b r y o embryo come to the third a tadpole has a dash and looks like a fish टैडपोल की क्या होती है अ टैडपोल हैज अ टेल ना एंड इट लुक्स लाइक अ फिश ना इसी वजह से यस द शेडिंग ऑफ द स्किन बिफोर न्यू स्किन ग्रोज इज कॉल्ड इसको क्या कहते हैं बेटा इट इज कॉल्ड मोल्टिंग एम ओ यू एल टी आई एन जी मोल्टिंग and caterpillar makes a shell called a dash around its body isko kya kehte hain cocoon c o c double o n na yes okay come here write true or false for the following mammal reproduce by laying eggs ये क्या एग दे के करते हैं नो दिस इज द फॉल्स दिस इज फॉल्स मैमल रिप्रोड्यूस बाय गिविंग बर्थ टू देयर बेबी ना यहाँ स्पेस नहीं है सो करेक्ट द फॉल्स स्टेटमेंट हम लोग यहाँ नहीं लिख पाएंगे द वाइट ग्लू लाइक लिक्विड अराउंड द योक इज कॉल्ड एल्बुमिन यस यू हैव सीन ना आप सब ने इसको देखा था ना बेटा ये the baby of a cockroach is called caterpillar caterpillar kehte hai kya no they are called nymph na a caterpillar shapes its skin many time yes of course it is true a turtle digs a hole in the ground to lay x this is also true this is also true dear okay children let's do the another one what is the another one children this is the this is the notebook work now we are going to start the notebook work you will write from a new page and you will fill the index index you will write today's date name of the lesson okay and from the new page you will start these defined words and very first you will write the name of the lesson then you will write defined words okay As you have done early, earlier, जैसा आपने पहले किया था देखो तो ये थोड़ा सा कट हो रहा है लेकिन मैं जो पी डी एफ दूंगी वहां पर क्लियर होगा लेसन नंबर एट रिप्रोडक्शन इन एनिमल ओके 
लेसन नंबर एट रिप्रोडक्शन इन एनिमल्स ये थोड़ा सा कट हो रहा है बट दिस इज दिसन नेम यू ऑल नो दिस इज इन द बुक एंड द वर्ड इज एंड यू विल लीव टू लाइन देन यू विल राइट डिफाइन वर्ड ए डिफाइन नंबर वन फर्स्ट वर्ड इज रिप्रोडक्शन द प्रोसेस बाय विच लिविंग थिंग्स प्रोड्यूस देयर यंग वंस यू विल लीव वन लाइन वन लिखने डिफाइन के बाद आप एक लाइन छोड़ोगे and molting the process of constantly shedding the old skin by animals is known as molting okay again you will leave the line what is albumin the white jelly substance surrounding the yolk of an egg is known as albumin come to the fourth one this is life span Life span is the amount of time between the birth and death of person, creature, or animal. Children, I will share this defined words in the PDF form. आप Edonex app पे e content में you can see this, हाँ, huh? and from there you will complete this. Children, read the lesson again and again and try to understand and complete your book exercises and this defined words in the next class we will complete the another book exercises and we will write the short question answer also okay children you all will complete the work meet you soon in the next class okay bye bye dear i hope you all will complete today's work the defined words and the book exercises you will complete from the pdf which i will share you can do yourself also then you do you first you do yourself then match it from the correct one ha huh? this is the right way and try practice it again and again okay children meet you soon in the next class and we will do the another thing of the same lesson bye bye dear